What's going on everyone? Alex De Silva, happy as Larry Group. I hope you are well. And welcome to your daily dose of happiness. Look at this sunshine beaming onto the side of my beard as it's very grizzly and fizzy to, frizzy today. It's not fizzy, it's very frizzy. It's just having, I'm having a bad beard day. <laughs> but look, I hope you are having an amazing week. I hope you're having an amazing day, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in the world. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys about something. I'm very, 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 very impatient. Very impatient. Please, let me know in your comments below. Are you impatient? Yes or no? Um, I want everything yesterday. You know, I want to, to, to grow this business globally yesterday. You know, I want to reach the millions, the billions of people. I want to help and I just want to serve and I just want to add value. And when I don't think I'm there, I really beat myself up. I really beat myself up. And I'm learning every single day to just keep things simple. Just keep it in the day. Just appreciate what I have, the things that I have to do in that day. You know, which for me in my morning practices, I always do my prayer, my meditation. I connect with God. I have gratitude. I do my affirmations. I have that time for me to build myself, you know, for that day, to build myself, to be of service, to help somebody, you know, when I'm speaking, whether I'm doing a video, whether I'm putting a post out or whether I'm just you know, working with a client, it doesn't matter what it is. Um, I try to kind of set myself up in that way. But you know what? My old behaviors catch me. You know, we are human beings at the end of the day. And we have this incredible machine called a brain, which remembers everything, everything, the good, the bad, the ugly, the dark, the darkest. And what it does when I'm in that place where, you know, I'm rising and I'm going and I'm pushing myself, it catches me and it always starts to then say to me, you're not good enough. You know, what are you doing? You're not doing enough. You know, look at what everybody else is doing. And I try to keep myself away from that as much as I possibly can. But what I have done is I listen very very carefully, you know, to people who I admire, to people who, you know, I I see doing incredible work. And what I have listened to and what I've learned is about, you know, is about being patient, but constantly working, constantly putting one foot in front of the other. And some days you're going to have great days, some days are going to be good, and some days aren't going to be that great. But it's okay, because every single day there is a learn. You know, there is there is a, a lesson, something that you've learned. And that is the most incredible thing I keep taking away from things. You know, people that I surround myself with, people that I say as I listen to, books that I read. And I've started to realize, you know, in, in, in my years of experience that I have, yes, I've been around for a little while, but from a business perspective, as in having my own business, you know, we're going to be four years at the end of this year. So we're still very young. And, you know, and I'm listening to people that I look up to, you know, and they're coming up to their 10th, 20th, 30th year of doing this stuff. And I'm looking at them going, that's who I want to be. That's where I want to get to. And they inspire me every single day, you know, and, and I have to remind myself that I am not there just yet. You know, these people inspire me because I want to be there. I want to be better than them. You know, I want to carry the torch for the work that they are doing, but I'm not there yet. You know, so I use them as teachers of, you know, for me to be able to learn. But one of the things I have to always listen to what they also say is, you know, to my mentors and, the, and even online mentors is, is this tough takes time. This stuff really does take time. If you're building your own business, if you're building yourself, whether the work is with you, whether it's with business, whether it's a relationship, it doesn't matter what it is. 
it takes time people it takes time and people give up before you actually reach the reward you know in my training today i had to do some really tough training this week there was a it's been a lot of running a lot of cardio and you know tuesday i had to do a 5k four times so the quickest i can and i beat myself up because i've been having problems with my back you know my legs have been a little bit sore but it was a personal best it was a personal best but because I stopped a couple of times, I beat myself up and I almost forgot to self-congratulate because I didn't think that was good enough. And um, and I'm really, really happy that I was able to just stop, just to take stop for a few minutes and then to be able to, to self-congratulate and say, Do you know what, well done, dude, because the last time I ran 5K, I beat it by two minutes, almost three minutes. And that's huge. That's a huge accomplishment. And I have to remind myself of that. Today was another running one. And the, the workout in total was over 50 minutes. And again, because I'm struggling with my shoulder and I've got this back thin and I had to scale the work down a little bit. And I started to beat myself up again. <laughs> and as can you see the pattern? Even though I'm doing really well, I still beat myself up. And I'm learning every single day not to do that, but to self-congratulate in every single step I take forward. Because if I'm sitting still or I'm standing still and I'm doing nothing, well, that's when I need to question, well, what are you doing? What are you actually doing? And you're not doing anything. That's when I have to write to then just question myself and say, come on, Alex, let's go and do something. Come on, let's go and get online. Come on, let's go and reach to some clients. You know, let's let, let's be pro proactive. Let's be productive today. And that's where I'm starting to see the differences. But these are learning curves. I'm starting to see now where I have to self-congratulate, even if it's the smallest of wins. So I wanted to share this with you guys because it's so easy for us to 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 put a dampener on, on everything we do and think that we're not good enough because we compare ourselves to other people. And I've started to realize that I can't really do that anymore. I can't do that. I have to stay in my own lane. But what I will do is surround myself with people that I want to become. You know, I want to surround myself with people who inspire me, who motivate me to get to that point, to be exactly where I want to be. Not that I'm going to be like them because they have their gift. God gave them that gift, but that gift inspires me to activate my gift even more. And that's what I keep learning every single day. And it's fantastic. I love it. And I want to share these nuggets with you guys as I grow, as we grow as a company, as I grow in every aspect of my life, I'm going to share it because I want you to do the same. So I hope you take something away today. Have an amazing day, afternoon evening wherever you are in the world and as always be great be fantastic be absolutely phenomenal today and take time remember we're here for life you know we're not going to get a little white you know we're not going to get a, a certificate or a prize at the end of it because the work continues so continue to continue continue to work continue to learn grow and develop and i'll speak to you again very soon take care